Today Amelia and I want to tell about a game that we like very much. It is called Stack Up. And it is a game, it's a co-op game, where we will try to make a stack of cubes on that board before this grumpy hand comes around and hits our stack. That'd be very rude. Hand, you shouldn't do that. But the hand does try to do that, doesn't it? Yeah, it is. Yeah, and it does. Now we have this wheel here that we can spin. Do you want to take a spin, Amanda? I already did purple. Let's try again to see if we get another color. Uh, it's in the middle. Want to try it again? Let's see. Purple! That's purple. That's purple. So it can be a color. It can be a hand. If it's a hand, the hand advances on that track. But that's not the case. We got purple. So I'm just going to put a block there in the middle of the board. And a young player could just take the block of the right color and put it there. But advanced players like Amelia use what? What do they use? The sticks and the wheel. The sticks, yeah, the sticks and the wheel. These sticks have these little, little thingies here that can go into holes in the cubes. Mm -hmm. Let's try again. Uh, my turn maybe? Uh-oh. The hand, and now the hand does advance. Let's try again. Okay, what, what, what do you want? Uh, orange. You can try orange. Then we'll show a challenge. Just do an orange one first. Oh. I have to spin again because it was in the middle. I was in the middle? Yeah. And... Green! You don't touch it with your hand. Oh, sorry. Sorry, you're right, Amanda. I don't touch it with my hand. My hands. So she can put those sticks in the holes and the stack is growing. Very good, Amanda. High five. Before the hand is coming. High five. Bang. Before the hand is coming. Uh, if you want another, if you want, you can also choose the foam ends. That's another option for players that like that <laughs> challenge. Uh, speaking of challenges, what happens if the wheel stops on the challenge space? Do you remember what happens? Yeah, we take a tile from that stack and there's a challenge that we have to compete together, Amelia and I. So I'm gonna get a stick, Amelia keeps that a stick, and together we have to do it while we also had this challenge. High five! Players make a high five and hold it. High five, Amelia. Hold it. Hold it. As we hold it, we do it. Purple. This purple? Yeah, purple. Purple. Okay. Ah, careful, careful, careful. We're doing a pattern. We're doing... Voila! Good job, us. Let's try another, another challenge. Suppose that we got this challenge instead. Roar! Players roar like a dinosaur as they are working together. Poppy, which which color? Mix mix. Mix mix. Very good. You mix yeah. the tiles. Which color? But Lulu and Azalea. Yeah, when Luisa was awake, Camilla mixed all the tiles in preparation for this review. Now, which block do we try now? Let's still do a pattern. Let's do a pattern. So we Maybe. do a green one. Very nice. Remember, we have a challenge. We need to roar. 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 I'm a dinosaur. Roar. 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 That was a close one, my dinosaur friend. And this is how it works. Sometimes you add the collar all by yourself. Sometimes there's a challenge that you always do with a friend. Sometimes the hand advances. If blocks fall, then also the hand advances. And if we run out of blocks and the color of that block comes out, the hand also advances. Just looking for excuses to move on and on and on and on and on and on and on. Ha. Boom. Boom! That's what the hand likes to do and sometimes children like to do too. So if we manage to put all 12 blocks in a stack in the middle of the box before the hand destroys the stack, 
we win. Otherwise, the hand wins and we need to try again. Like, yeah. Yeah. What? What? Uh, What's yeah. that hand doing? Do you like this game, Amelia? <laughs> See, the good thing about the cop is that in this game, uh, in this cop game, even if the board wins, it's fun. Because the child gets to be the, the AI, the bad guy, and it's almost as fun as winning the game. What do you like about this game, Amanda? I can put the hand on top of the stick. That's, that's an added bonus. I like the fact that we can play together, we can move the blocks together, that there's a lot of variety, that the challenges are different, that Amanda is still pretending to be a dinosaur, I think. Are you trying to bite me with little no, dinosaur? I'm gonna eat. I'm trying to eat the blocks. Do they look like candies to you? <laughs> uh, yummy blocks. They should look good, component-wise. Ah! They look like grapes. They look like grapes. And these are green grapes. Yeah. And these the are oranges. And How about these, these ones? These, this is rain. Yeah. I love rain. Yeah, so the game can be very simple for a little child just choosing colors and putting them there. Harder for older kids just with the sticks. Even harder with the challenges. So I like this game. We played it a lot with different rules, adding some rules sometimes and not some of the times. Amelia would you like to play a game next? Wanna play a game now? Uh, yeah. Yeah, okay. So Time for us to say hi because we need to go and play a game of Stuck Up, published by Peaceful Kingdom, a game that I made a like and I enjoy very much. Want to say hi to our friends? Hi. Hi, friends. <laughs>